Hello, I'm William Gifford. I'm the founder and owner of Trigger Tales, a company focused on custom unique furniture for dogs or other pets. <coughs> we want to provide furniture that can also double as a kennel for dogs or other pets. This started as a project for myself when we were keeping our dog's wireframe kennel in the living room. My wife hated how it looked and didn't like when people came over and saw the ugly wireframe where it was clearly visible. After creating our first piece, Friends and others expressed interest in their own kennels. Because of this, we are targeting dog owners that are obsessed with and willing to spend money on their dogs. These would be people that buy clothes for their pets, special leashes, and the newest toys. Each kennel is currently handmade and custom to the customer's preference. To help speed up, we limit size and certain features, but paneling options, color, and a few design elements are all customizable to the customer. We had some great success in creating buzz with customers and finding the next customer was not difficult. With high satisfaction, the passion that our customers have makes them natural advocates for our products. While we have seen success so far in the company, the one thing that we want to improve before moving forward is to have a well-defined process to increase our production speed to help train new employees. For this test run over the last six weeks, I sold one kennel for $100 and a second at $120 for a total sales of $220. <coughs> with, with the cost of goods sold and no current overhead, the profit from the sales is estimated at $134.14, or a margin of profit of 61%. The actual labor hours from myself was a little over 40 hours, but that is estimated to go down dramatically. Further, I was able to get half the costs covered up front as part of a down payment. In the future, we are increasing costs of the kennels between 180 for small kennels and 220 for large kennels. What you see here on the screen is a projected costs and profits if we were to apply uh, the future model to what we or have already sold. This is still a very competitive cost and customer kennels like this can go as high as $400 in the market. I've also added anticipated hours based on $10 an hour. While I spent an average of about 20, 20 hours on each kennel, a lot of this was wasted time going back to the store or fixing mistakes or remeasuring or verifying certain things. This time can easily be cut down to seven to eight hours with the correct process and standards. We could even possibly go faster depending on the experience of the employee. The profit margin decreases to 41%, which is still wonderful, and total profit goes up on the same amount built. Currently, the costs are low, with the overhead being non-existent as it's ran out of my garage. Further, <coughs> all the tools that were needed, I already possessed. I can keep costs this way until we hit over 42 kennels a month. This is assuming up to two people working in the garage at a pace of seven and a half hours per kennel in four weeks in a month. At that point, we will need a bigger facility and more tools to facilitate more workers along with upgrades for the whole shop. I'm looking for a monetary investment of $20,000 and a partner with experience in the initial growth stages of a startup for 35% of the company. I need help sourcing suppliers, acquiring capital upgrades and lease arrangements. You feel like we would be, make good partners and you fit this bill? I would be glad to have you. Have a great day.